Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back. Episode 4, Up the Orange, our FM21 Netherlands save at De Graaf Stop, De Graaf Shop, something like that. I try to roll, but it's not happening. Uh, this is weird. I've seen this before, you know, players get mad when you sell somebody. So that's not unusual. Body Selleck has fallen out. He hasn't raised a concern to me but check this out so nijman no longer concerned about the sale of this guy he changed his mind as he feels we've been doing much better on the same day 11 minutes later body selick has a falling out because he's furious about the sale of star roll van bokel beckel and RC's inability to reassure him about the transfer. Okay. Now, I, I, I don't remember. Maybe he was upset before, but here's where this gets interesting, right? So, Roll Van Beckel. I haven't sold anybody recently. We sold Van Beckel three months ago. Hello. And he was good. I would have liked to have kept. But hello, three months ago. Three months ago. And he's played two matches. But yeah, so I'm I'm confused as to what's going on here. Don't know. I have no idea. Uh, anyway, taking a look at recent matches, stuff that's actually happened. We haven't played a lot, uh, but we did uh, have a two-two draw with Fortuna, Sitard, Makawi, and Muhammad with the goals, a penalty in the 90th minute, and Young Ajax five nil. Isaac Hellstrom with a brace, Muhammad with a first half brace, and Stamen with a goal. All of our goals coming in the first half before our legs fell off because I run them to death. Uh, we did lose Deera to a red card uh, in the Sitard match. Uh, that probably didn't help. And Selick is down for a couple of weeks, I believe. Yeah, he's out for a couple of weeks with pulled ankle ligaments. So. Yeah, I don't know what he, you know, I guess all that free time now, he's he's on, in the trainer's room. He's uh, just thinking about things from three months ago, like before the season even started. Oh, by the way, <clears throat> one of the things that I didn't really realize, I had seen it. Now, we're only shooting for a mid-table finish. So it's weird because we do have an overall. Oh, top goal score. Hello. Nice. Kook, highest average rating. Most assists. Oh, that's for us. I thought that was for the league. My bad. Let's take a look there, see what we've got. Uh, Muhammad is third in scoring. Sander Boone with 17. Wow. And Viral, six clean sheets. That's not bad at all. But I noticed here, we actually have four periods. So it looks like you have to win... If you if you win a period, you get a playoff berth. And then if you end up, so like even if they fall off the face of the earth and finish 20th, they could still finish with a playoff berth. Is that right? But they won, I guess, on wins. Uh, we had four draws, no losses, equal points, equal goal differential. So I guess it went to wins. Uh, they ended up there, yeah, because we even had the four, we had a draw of nothing else. But they won that, so we're into the second period now and tied with them. First game, you know, only one game, but that, that's interesting, these period tables. That's going to be something interesting to get used to. But we'll figure that out as we go. Rowan Peters. Well, he can play left wing. He can't cross, but he would be he would be a strong central mid. He would be a real strong central mid. I may have to give some thought to that. I'll have to look at that, but not today. All right, team selection. Because we're still riding this horse. All right, Martinez, McCowey up top, Stamen, Toll and Hellstrom on the wings, Wreckers. Dira, Nijman, Kook, and Dahan with Viral. Oh, this is a, uh, you know what? I want to, I want to pick more rotation 
and Sayud. Let's give Sayud a start. It, it's a cup match, right? So there's Peters, Cole, Vandermeulen, Van Ijma, Martinez, Bunu, Nijman. So De Bruyne's in there. All right, we'll go with that. It, that's a pretty heavy rotation. We'll have to keep a close eye. Actually, you know what? I don't want De Bruyne in there. Uh, let's go with uh, let's go with Dahan. We'll do that. Pretty heavy rotation, but eh, you know, it is a cup match. All right, let's get into it. I'm trying to figure out what the uh, what these little things are oh there they go they just weren't registering anything gotcha gotcha all right the ball inside a little bit of bunching up like some eight-year-olds good ball out to Dahan. there's the cross in and tackled away i think that's going to be out on us and it is a goal kick All right, Dahan into the box. A good fight by our center back to get that ball. Beat the man, beat the man. There's a cross and a header, and it's Thibaut Martinez, his fourth goal of the season for the striker. And, you know, you're usually looking for, you don't see, a, I don't see a lot of header goals. From your strikers. That was cool. Very happy with that. All right, Bonru or Buru. Boo Ray. Boo Ray's a card game if you're not sure. All right, nice ball in, and he pings it into the net. Rignald Van Ijma, his first goal of the season. And that was our second goal in a three minute span. Not to like that. That's a nice shot. Lumped out. Played right back. Right back. We're we're just we're in a volley contest here. We end up winning. Oh, what a step over. Oh, look at that ball. That was a nice vision pass. Oh, taken down in the box. They do not call the penalty. No penalty there. Wow. I'm a little upset with that. Where's VAR? Pretty sure we should have had a penalty there. All right, let's focus. Uh, nope. Dahan picks it up. We're controlling the ball well. Oh, look at that pass by Van de Haan. A second shot, Van der Mullen, his first goal of the season, and his first goal for the club, Timo Van der Mullen, is on the score sheet, and it's 3-0. That was a good job by getting back on that ball. Very happy here. Um, Peters. Peters is playing well. I mean, a 6-9, but everybody else is playing astounding. All three of our goals from our guys up top. That is nice. 2.05 to 0.05. Wow. Just a dominant affair. 19 shots to one. Uh, hands in pockets. Don't get complacent. Seemed motivated. All right. Vanderhaar, that's okay. Did they just, they, oh, that must have been their subs. I was like, what's going on? Tell you what, you know, we can do that. We can pull a couple of guys. Let's find us some guys that haven't played yet. Uh, let's see. Stamen Hellstrom. Sabuni can Banu play anywhere else because he doesn't play a lot. He can play 
Now Peters is doing all right. Can Peters move over? Mid left, mid center. Azar, he could come in in the defensive mid, but Vandahar doesn't play a lot. How about Kashindi? Yeah, let's bring let's bring uh, Nijman off for Kashindi. Give him a start, and you know what? Need him. He's only played two matches. Let's get him in here. Give him about ten extra minutes. Try to knock some rust off of him. Oh, that was a nice uh, direct pass. Defense luckily played some tough ball there and held him up. Let's uh, focus. There's Toll. We are really controlling the ball, but you know it's a, they're a uh, they're a semi-pro team, and we should be dominating this game for sure. I think that was just showing off. Just showing off, man. They pick up an injury. They still only have one shot. Over the top. There's Toll. <clears throat> Too late with the cross attempt. All right, they got one there. There's a header, goes over the bar. Nothing to get really excited about in this match. We are dominating. I'd like a few more shots on target, but what are you going to do? All right, we do have a couple of guys getting tired, so we'll keep an eye on that for the third and final sub. Vander Mullen. Of course, if you know, maybe Vandahar, we don't pull him off. He doesn't play a lot, so... You know, if he runs down into the red, it doesn't hurt us. That's the assumption, at least. That was a weird-looking pass. Good touch and put into the net by Rowan Peters. His first goal of the season. They blame that on the keeper. We'll go with that, but it is a fourth goal as we are running away with things here. By far the better side. Hard to get excited about that, you know? All right, let's uh, take a look at that sub. And uh, you know what? I want to customize this. Bear with me. Wanted to uh, wanted to bring in uh, appearances here, and that way I can just at a glance maybe see who has not played any games? So Kashindi. Everybody else has played. Van Ijma. Uh let's go ahead and bring Kazar on. And we'll bring him on for Vandahar. I believe that's who we're gonna do. There we are. Just you know, trying to get some game time for some of our younger players or some of our guys that just haven't been able to play much. Hopefully not much in the way of added time. You just really don't want any more risk of injury at this point. We're only expected to make it to the second round, so we are going to do that comfortably here. But we could be <laughs> we could be in this the opposite position uh, in our next match, unfortunately, just depending on who we play. There's a nice ball movement. Back out into some space. Needham gets a highlight reel. Into Kazar. There's a square. Oh, look at that. Empty netter for John Toll. They just went all the way around the keeper. That was a beautiful buildup. That was some beautiful football. Look, oh, just a quick pass. Over to Toll at the back post before the keeper could adjust over. That's beautiful. Let's go ahead. Oh, crap. I berated him. 
I'm so used to praise being the bottom option, and now it's not. <laughs> that was horrible. Uh, uh, geez. Uh, let's go outstretched arms. A good win. Well done. Nothing wrong with that at all. All right. I tell you what. Let's come right back. We'll be back for the next match. We got $50,000 for that. Kashindi makes his debut. Two assists and 13 key passes. I'm going to pat him on the shoulder and tell him his passing was awesome. All right, we'll be right back, and we'll take a look at the, the dynamics. I just kind of want to look at how the squad is adapting to me uh, now that we're a little way into the season. So we'll see you guys back here in a second. All right, so we're going to take a look at the dynamics real quick. So we have two players who are unhappy. Uh, Seppi Rikers, uh, or Wreckers, our defensive mid, wants to leave to play in a better division, and I have promised him I would try to sell him. Uh, we have until the end of the next transfer window, so we'll have to replace him. And then uh, Fadi Selleck, of course, unhappy at the sale. And we've got one player, Lars McCowie, who agrees with him. So we're dealing with that, but, you know, not much we can do. Our hierarchy, taking a look, we have 13 players who support me, 15 players with no real opinion, but no players in opposition. So that's good. That gives, uh, we have good team cohesion. Leadership support has moved to very good and is inching upward. Club atmosphere is very good as well. So pretty happy there. Uh, social groups, one major group, a secondary group uh, of three players, uh, one with two players just because they've only been at the club a short time. And... Nico Sabuni, 24 years old. Didn't he just join us? Yeah, he just joined us from Telstar. We've got to play him. I mean, we paid a million dollars for him, right? So everything's looking good there. We're going to take a look at the tactical meeting. Uh, oh, we pulled a uh, mid-table uh, club from this division for the next cup match. So we'll be able to look at that. We'll be able to look at that here in a minute once I can see the table. All right, McCowey, Muhammad, Stamen back up top, Toll, Hellstrom on the wings, Wreckers in the back, Deera, Nijman, Cooch, Dahan, and Viral in goal. Now, Sabuni, he's left back. Let's compare him with Deera. So Deer, uh, Sabuni's in green, so he's better mentally more speed a little more just they're basically the same player right sabuni however is our player dira is here on loan so i think i think we are going to give him a crack at it i believe we're going to do that eight changes from the last match but that was because we played a heavily rotated side last time out I have uh, I have converted our second uh, um, tactic to it's basically the same as this one, but instead of a four with a diamond, it's two central mids and two attacking wingers. So we'll give them a little while to play that. That was what it had told us last time to try to play. Um, some of our guys in their more natural positions and it was Dordrick that's who we're playing in the next in the next cup match all right we are back at it here Saburi there he gets a highlight early on completes a pass Hellstrom on the right side drives into the box and easy save for Rickers in goal Saburi into the box, headed out. Wreckers comes back to it. Stamen turns the corner. Oh, he was looking in that slot there. Beautiful pass. And Rickers makes the save at the near post. That was going in. Little unlucky. Stamen tracks down the clearance header. We are Back on the attack. 
and nothing develops there. So let's, uh, well, gonna have to demand some more here. We're gonna take a corner near post, and it's in McCowie. He's in double digits, 10 goals on the season. And that was stellar. Near post. Got to like that. Got to like that a lot. And we've opened up a six-point margin on the table as a whole. Hit it in. I wonder if there's any way mathematically that you could never win a stage and there's an offsides goal disallowed hellstrom in the wrong place i think that's our first goal that i've seen called back for offsides uh he just drifted in yep good call demand more sabuni so looks like he's given everything really no he, he got a little rest there he got a breather Oh man, 0.95 to 0.29. So I guess we're they're saying we're a little lucky to get that goal. Uh encourage the team. Nope. Things are going well. I know you're capable of even better. Ooh, aggressive. They're fired up. All right. Want to be looking at these guys. I think we're going to be taking Sabiri off sooner rather than later. But we wanted to get him some match time. There's a nice ball into space. Blocked away. Counter is on. Oh my god, an own goal. He tried to clear it and it bounced into Wreckers and went into the goal. Brilliant defensive play, but Wreckers turned his back and it just went right off his heel. No shot for the keeper there. Oh, that's brutal. And hopefully that does not... Hopefully that does not cause us all kind of problems. Tell you what, let's bring Peters on there. We'll swap them back around. Oh, man. That was not good. I was getting ready to say, I hope that doesn't cause us to lose focus. Now I'm going to berate them and mean it. We need to just be doing better. And they are getting all the highlights. It is all Excelsior all the time. Good tackle. Knocked away. Right. Finding a little space. Trying to work it around that midfield. There's Deera who's just come on. Got an overlap. Peters is on. Good ball into the middle. Stamen runs it through, and Hellstrom cannot put it into the net. We do get a corner out of it. Dira bends it in, and it is headed away cleanly. Hellstrom brings it back up into the attack. I'll drop it in. Oh, no. I don't know what he was trying to do. It looked like he was trying to take a shot, and I thought he was going to lay the pass in. Demand more. We've already made two subs. Elstrom is not playing well. Do I have anybody else? Shit, he just came in. 
He just came in. I don't have anybody else to bring there. Who do I have up here? You know what? He didn't play badly last time. Let's bring him in, Vandermeulen, and see if that gives us something here on the offensive side of the field. Demand more again. Come on, boys. All right. There's a good interception. Played through. Vandermeulen. Oh, he was looking to be the super sub coming off and scoring. Five minutes of stoppage. We're going to go up to positive. Actually, we're going to go up to attacking. And we are going to take our first defeat on the season. 0.52, and they got two goals. That own goal, I mean, that one goal was really quality by Hamzui, but ugh, an own goal loss. I'm going to throw a water bottle. They didn't like that. Achievement unlocked. Attack. Oh, there's an update available. Attack scored 20 consecutive matches, 21.7%. Uh, I wonder store page i wonder what the update is a hot fix here we go how did that not update for me today when i just updated the oh well because that doesn't affect me i suppose but i'll have to restart steam i can do that uh here since i finished recording uh we are going to criticize him disappointed uh he is still performing well but i don't Potential issue with McCowie. Uh-oh, so he's downcast. Let's see. So do I convince him or do I promise him? So I think he was upset that I threw the water bottle. Okay, so I'll make a promise to you. I can do that. We'll see how that works out. I just can't throw water bottles anymore. Ten-game unbeaten run ends, but we are still three up. Or two up and points. Uh oh, my assistant manager is fearing struggles now with the unbeaten run coming to an end. Well, the loss looms large. Let's come back. Um, let me see. Where's the next Dutch Cup match? Oh, it's down here, Dondrick, in, in December. So I tell you what. Emmon's going to be a crucial game. Why don't we come back for Emmon and Dondrek? And then we'll, so we'll be, you know, that top of the table matchup. We'll also have a cup match. And looks like the second period should end in early, De early December. So if we come back there, that should be right after. So we'll see how we end up in the second uh, table as well. So let's do that. Guys, hit the like button. Subscribe if you're new or you haven't done so yet. Thank you very much. And uh, hey, we'll see you next time. Take care. Bye.